Uh, I want to show a, a, a little bit of a recipe and something that I like to cook and it's really simple, really easy for a single guy who works a lot and um, I call it my stout pot roast. So what I'm doing now is I'm melting butter, uh, about a spoonful of butter in the, uh, the frying pan and I've got some peppered bacon in here. While that's cooking, I'm over here and I'm getting this ready to go. This is my round pot roast. And basically what I'm doing is I'm throwing a little bit of seasoning on it. Rubbing it all in. So I just now the bacon's just to add a little bit of flavor to what I'm gonna be doing next. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take the pot roast and I'm gonna take it and put it in the frying pan and I'm gonna sear all the edges. So now that you've got it seared on all the sides, what you do is you take it, you put it into the slow cooker. And this is where the stout comes from. You take a, a stout beer, uh, you can do things like Guinness or a Sam Adams cream stout or something like that. And what you do is you pour it into the slow cooker. Now what you want to do is you want to go up about a half an inch to an inch on the roast. Depending on the size of the roast, depends on how much you use. But remember that when you cook it, juices will be released and it will make even more juices in here. I use, like you said, I use one about one bottle is all what it's going to take for uh, my little three pound roast. And what you do is you turn it on. I put it on high, put the top on it, walk away, let it sit overnight, and then next morning you throw in vegetables that you want, you turn it down to low, and when you get home the next day, you've got you a full meal that will last a single guy three, four days. There you go. Quick, easy, and done in about 15 minutes. So I forgot to bring you in the air earlier when I was uh, um, chopping up the potatoes and adding the potatoes to it. Um, well, I let them sit until they're really tender, and then I came in here and I pulled out the pot roast, and I broke it up. I just pulled it apart. Here's what it looks like now. Um, I then made it a little bit of a gravy. So after you pour the gravy in the pot, you let it sit there, and um, then I guess in a few hours when I'm ready to eat, I will make a pot of rice, and I'll have me some awesome meals. Yeah. So guys, remember, a smiling face makes the world a better place. So be well, be blessed, and enjoy your day. So I've had a really good week. Um, I put up a video on my second channel uh, called Random. So <clears throat> I just, I have to try this. I really, 